KDDI's mobile phone network system glitch has had effects on various other services. Tokyo police said the number of emergency calls they received on July 2nd and 3rd was about 10 percent fewer than the figure from the previous weekend. The drop was likely due in part to the system failure that began in the wee hours of July 2nd. Police officials said the number of emergency calls made from cell phones operated by KDDI decreased while those from public phones increased. They said calls received over the weekend included those checking that they can get through to the emergency line with an AU mobile phone and another informing the police that an AU shop clerk and a customer were arguing. The service disruption also affected medical care. The Tokyo Metropolitan Government's follow-up center that monitors the health condition of coronavirus patients recuperating at home could not contact about 120 people each on July 2nd and 3rd. The center normally cannot get in touch with about 20 patients a day. As of July 3rd, the center was monitoring the condition of about 2,300 patients. The Japanese Weather Agency's automated meteorological data acquisition system has been unable to stably send nationwide observation data to the agency since July 2nd. The system gathers temperature and rainfall data at about 1,300 observation points across the country. But agency officials said they could not receive data from numerous points, up to around 500 at a time. Among other businesses affected, Rakuten Mobile, which uses KDDI's connection, also experienced service disruptions. Parcel delivery staffers at Yamato Transport were unable to contact customers using their mobile phones over the weekend. There were also problems with Yamato's online system for tracking parcels. At a regional bank headquartered in central Japan, 190 of its 221 ATMs were out of service at the time their operation was scheduled to begin on July 2nd. Keisei Bus could not display its bus location and delay information on its website. As for the auto industry, Toyota Motor experienced trouble with its security system that uses internet connection. Suzuki Motor's connected cars were unable to reach operators for emergency services.